I have your new orders captain. I want you to proceed to Tea Gardens Star. You will be trying to find out what happened to a survey vessel, USS Juno five years ago. You may wish to refresh my memory, Admiral. What is a Tea Garden Star? It is a red dwarf star 12 light years from Earth, with two Earth-like exoplanets orbiting it. The inner planet is known to have had a civilization on it, as reported by the Juno. That ship was in the area of the star five years ago. Light consistent with an antimatter explosion reached a listening post last month, and it came from the direction of Tea Garden's star. It is believed that the Juno self-destructed. We want to know why. So are we investigating the planet, the missing ship or boat? Both Captain. Starfleet believes that the inner planet is involved somehow, but we don't know if it was an act of war, an accident or something else. This is an investigation, not a recovery operation. Watch your step, Captain. Ensign Janna, I want this information put together in a report about Tea Garden Star as soon as possible. Yes, Captain. Right away. Nice meeting you, Admiral. Well Ensign, what did you find out? Report on the system. The race is unidentified. They appear to be, or have been, a reclusive race who had a penchant for computer technology. The Juno found technology superior to ours. Oddly, there seems to have been little space travel other than a space station that was reported. We have been getting odd signals from the area. It appears there is something active there, and it is not Federation technology. I have landing parties set up, all ready to go. Both planets appear to be Class M. We will use shuttlecraft to investigate the planets. The Constitution will look for debris from the Juno and investigate the space station. We arrive in about two hours. Dismissed. Captain's Log. We are closing in on Tea Garden Star and are ready to institute an investigation. Entering the Tea Garden Star system. Two planets orbiting a red dwarf star. One space station and, Captain, a ship resembling the Juno near a space station. Attempt to contact the Juno. Ascertain her status. No life signs, Captain. Life support on minimal. No damage that I can see. Very well. Have engineering rig up a power transfer to the Juno. That should get her life support online. Also prepare a boarding party. What about the space station? Minimal readings captain. One habitable area, small. It looks like a control area. Launch shuttle craft. Close on the Juno. As soon as the teams are ready, beam two officers to the station and four to the Juno. Power levels are low. Reactor is offline. It looks like they shut everything down. We can make her operational again. The ship needs refueling. They drained off the antimatter and detonated it well away from the system. I will try to access their logs and find out what happened here. Okay we will do what we can. I don't care much for being dependent on the constitution while we are over here.
This station is a relay area, talking to stations on the surface of the close planet. It is managing thousands of them, and it looks like there is something similar to our pattern storage buffers from our transporters, but on a massive scale. We need full diagnostics on this station before we head back to the ship. It is from the Juno all right. A single occupant escape pod. No one is inside. Someone must be here. I found a skeleton, confirmed to be the occupant of this pod. Apparently he has been dead for at least four years. My tree quarter says he may have died from blunt force trauma of some kind. Your presence has been This is an old laboratory, but the equipment is still functional. I read thousands of life storage units. Storage as energy, like with our transporters in pattern buffers. This is a quantum singularity used to power this equipment. Its output is almost off the scale. Can we investigate without going inside, if you can call it that? I don't believe so. We can learn something from out here, but not much. If two of us go, can you bring us back? Yes I can. This equipment is still functional. I don't know what to expect. I volunteer to join you if you go. We need to get the captain's permission first. Two hours, no more. We need to find out what has happened here. Welcome special guests. Won't you come in? I am Landru Hines, and this is Julie Bonney. We represent the United Federation of Planets. Our mission is peaceful, 
and we are here to contact you to find out what happened to your planet. You stress such unimportant things. Everything is perfect here. It is a paradise without end. Join us. It's easy, just stay. This is wonderful. We should consider staying. Everything is perfect. I think it is sickening. We have been to several houses. Everything is always perfect. This is all wrong. Hey that is different. A small shack. Oh no, look. A giant insect. Let's take shelter in the shack. Hurry. Welcome Federation guests. You are safe in here. My name is Victor Payne. Yes I was stationed for a while on a planet in one of those backwater colonies on the planet orbiting Barnard's star. It was a great place to go. You should have seen the way the sky lit up with its aurora. I think you are full of it. That planet is a high gravity planet. It is dark and dismal. I like his stories whether they are true or not. He may be silly but he sure is fun. Well let me tell you about what happened on Titan on the ore processing facility there and Phase of fire. Break room. Come on. Dead. There are no marks on the body, but Phaser hits on the bulk head. Call the bridge. What did he die from doctor? He had an aneurysm which burst. I found elevated adrenaline levels, like he was terrified of something. What does security have to say about this? He was shooting at something. The bulk head was damaged by phase of fire. We found him dead. Excuse me captain, we have two missing crew members, both women. Alright, I want a full search of the ship. Double security patrols. Excuse me captain. We have detected energy similar to our transporter signals. We detected a burst of it in the rec room about the same time as this incident. Raise the shields engineer. Notify the bridge to keep them up until further notice. <laughs> 